You are now listening to 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Let's go! Right. Yeah, man. It's much better. The touch of the empire. I'll be in the spot in my bag life. I'm walking through the club like I'm 50 cents yeah. I'm with my homies and these niggas know we with the shit I'm walking through the club like I'm Max B Cause I'm the waviest nigga out if you ask me I'm walking through the club like I'm Big me. We chains on, we pulled up in 6G I'm walking through the club like my name Paul And we just dropped 60,000 for the semi yeah. Cruising in my Beamer through New York City blocks I'm federally hot so nigga fuck a city cop Where I'm going now you battled yesterday. Yeah, of course, yeah. I didn't get a uh, chance to chop it up with you. Nah. Um, uh, you battled Chef Trez. Yeah. And boy. uh, in the building they were saying uh, he three old you clearly. In the building they said this plan. A lot of people were, were were saying it was a debatable. Yeah. Uh, some people were saying you edged it. Some people said yeah. he edged it. How do you how do you feel about you? I feel like you? I won. I feel, I feel like I won. Mm-hmm. I feel like I won all three rounds. Like all I, feel, three. I feel like it was close though. Like you know what I'm saying? I feel like he did good. I feel like his first round was crazy. You know what I'm saying? I feel like his, his, his ability to freestyle is is a gift because like you can really be losing a round and really bring it back. Right. Where, like what a rebuttal like as simple as that i'll knock you out like the motherfucker in the crowd was it just works so well it it just worked and that's what's special about him like you know what i'm saying now now you came out a lot of people are uh are uh beating you up a little bit about i don't care your chef (laughs) when you get the apron and the hat on yeah keep talking about (laughs) what talk to me about that man i don't know i just felt like doing something different you know Mm. what i'm saying i don't know just set my thought about when I jumped up the plane, like, yo, you know what I'm saying? I should go buy an apron and a hat just to wear it. I was going to actually, on, on, on my mother, I was going to have girls bring it to me. I was, uh, the line was, um, that hey, girls, fire. bring my apron here. That would have been fire. But girls wasn't in the, like, he, but he said he wasn't going to get the building or whatever, so. But, like, I feel like, I, I was, I swear to God, you could ask him. I was going to have him, like, yo, girls, bring my apron here. And, like, I, I yo, that would have shook like the whole fucking building. Though. Yeah, word. Yeah, that would have been a room shake if girls brought out the apron. And That's you had the hat on. Yeah, had the hat on. The hat and shit. Chef Boy Looking like on Chef Boy on it. Had the <laughs> Chef Boy on it. <laughs> now, um, uh, every every round, you thought you was... To me. Like, I'm a feel like mm. To me. He was good, though. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's the baby. Like, I wouldn't be mad if somebody said, yo... He won the first or he beat you too. I ain't gonna go so. It was a good one. Like I told him before we did it, like we gotta make it a good one and shit. Y'all face off was pretty good too. Yeah. So that 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 made me want to see the battle a little bit more. Yeah, right. Sometimes those face offs work, sometimes, sometimes they don't. You yeah. know. Sometimes. Yeah, that one happened after, after the work, so. T Top and uh, Rum Nitty is just like, I, I don't wanna see this battle, but I'm glad I did. That I had a good, good battle. I already battled battle yeah. the night. Um, with Tay Rock and Cave Shine. Like, right. So what, what's your record with Cave Gang now? 4-0. 4-0? No. No. Yeah. So Clearly. Like, clear, like 4-0. No. Even if it's debatable, like, it's any, if I'm 4-0 on this thing. <laughs> 15 Minutes of Fame. You are now listening to 15 Minutes of Fame. Radio. Let's go.